Hey Adjusters, we had a fair number of people come into the class the other day, uh, that was day two, who had never used Sketch before, but had experience in Xactimate. And so I wanted to do a little demonstration that will show the difference between Sketch and Dimensioning, for those of you that are used to Dimensioning. So I'm going to create a new project called Sketch versus Dimension, and I'll hit Add New Project. Let's wait for a second while it opens. What I'm going to do is I'm going to create a room in Dimensioning and create the very same room in Sketch and show you how the two are similar. So those of you who use Dimensioning can see the Sketch equivalent and those of you who use Sketch can see the Dimensioning equivalent. So I'm going to go straight to Estimate Items. Okay, and in Estimate Items I'm going to create a new room called the Bedroom and I'll attach that room and if those of you used to dimensioning will understand this process but I'm going to double click here and I'm going to give this room some dimensions so let's say that this room is uh, 13 by 13 with an 8 foot height Okay, but let's also suppose that this room has a small jog so I click add and I'm going to call this the jog. And this jog, let's say, is 5 um, by 5 with an 8-foot height. And for those of you familiar with uh, dimensioning, you'll know that you have to add a missing wall between those two. And I'll say the length is 5, the height is 8, opens to the floor and ceiling. That's correct. Opens into the bedroom. That's correct. Hit OK. And close. And OK. All right. Now close that up. And you'll see I've got my bedroom dimension, which is manifest by the little um, tape measure display there. Now, I'm going to go create that very same room over in Sketch. So in Sketch, head over to the Sketch tab. I'm going to click on the Room tool. Move my cursor over to the palette. Right there. Place the room down. Adjust my measurements so that this is a 13 by 13 room, just like the one I just mentioned. Okay. 13 by 13. Then I'm going to use the square break tool here up in the toolbar to make a small break in the room. I'm going to pull this out to 5 feet and adjust my sizes. Five feet, right? And there is a 1313 room with a 5x5 five five jog, and I'll call it bedroom 2. All right, so there is a room created in Sketch, and if I go over to Estimate Items, you'll see both rooms. I've got bedroom here and bedroom 2 here. Now, to prove that these rooms do in fact have the same amount of square footage that they're equivalent, I'm going to hold down Control key, highlight them both. So they're both highlighted now. I'm going to add paint to the wall surfaces for both of these. So I'll search for paint one coat. There's painting one coat. Apply it to both rooms on the wall surface. Hit OK. Now let's take a look at the first bedroom that we created in Dimensioning. It has 496 square feet of paint the walls. And on the bedroom, two, created in sketch, 496 square feet. Okay? And both of them, as you can see up here, have exactly $173.60 in paint. Now, the difference, well, one of the differences is that if you go to print to see how this ends up displaying on the report, go to print, and let's go to view. For the room created in dimensioning, let's wait till it loads up. Okay, let's take a look at the difference here. The room created in dimensioning.
is right here. Here's the bedroom with the subroom, the jog. All the square footage laid out there and the linear footage. And here is paint the walls. Now if we scroll down a bit, we're going to get to the room created in Sketch. See it there? It's got an actual proportional or scaled drawing of that room with square footage next to it. And you've got paint the walls. Okay. Now let's head down to the bottom here of this estimate. And only the room that we created in Sketch will be shown here. But you'll see that we have a actual diagram of the room from having created it in Sketch. So I'm going to hit Escape to get out of this print preview. Escape again. So what I did here is I created a room in Dimensioning, created the same room in Sketch to show you how they are the same and different. It's two ways to skin the cat, but I believe personally the Sketch version is better because you actually have um, a clearer report that has a two-scale proportional drawing and a sketch of that room. And with that, I'll wrap it up.